welcome uh, in uh, this uh, video tutorial about Vim here is my starting directory it's a Laravel project and we can see typical Laravel project here uh, we have some uh, stuff file that we can of course remove and um, yeah let's remove this file because it's not uh, we should and uh, let's see what we have it is a clear uh, clear uh, laravel project so and uh, we have our structure and let's start uh, vim and uh, we want to understand how to use vim as, uh, as we can use uh, sublime or uh, visual studio code and we can want to navigate uh, and uh, to find easily file and the file and the stuff using the built-in commands of uh, this powerful editor and just uh, for fun let's uh, compare the nerd, nerd tree extension of vim here we go i press enter on my keyboard and i can see my tree file tree command and i can navigate uh, inside you can go for example in resources view and i pressing T I can open a new tab and I can edit this file again I press uh, return and I can open a new a new tab and there we go and uh, to move here we go and uh, I can of course navigate so this is uh, basically the um, functionalities of uh, uh, nerd tree and uh, to discover uh, the functionality we can press uh, nerd tree from the peer oh we can focus or toggle and uh, you are the basic uh, command to focus to close or simple and um, it's a very useful fundamental um, extension of vim and uh, i in fact i use and uh, another that uh, i suggest to use is uh, GTR, gtrp with another extension and uh, it's nice because uh, it uh, cache all the um, project there and you can navigate uh, in uh, your uh, files very easily as uh, recursively and uh, you can open uh, pressing t control t and here we go and uh, it's another way so these are the main um, uh, way to navigate using plugin or using nerd tree or uh, using um, uh, gtrp another fundamental uh, add-on of vim but uh, we can um, avoid uh, plugins we just uh, want to use the built-in uh, functionalities and uh, let's go in the command mode and uh, let's see which hour which is our directory this is my directory and uh, this is my my tree my project tree and uh, let's say that i want to open a file so open a file press e write e and the name of file 
and if you press tab appear all uh, a list of options that you can select in my case i want to open in in the resources the uh, dire so i move using the arrows and to go inside press the down down arrow and you see another list uh, with the content of the the directory and uh, i want to move into views directory and here is a list of uh, of files uh, our blade file and you see that the directories are uh, uh, f the finish with the slash uh. so if i want to enter into into the i press down and i enter in the, into the layout uh. if i want to return uh, there i go press again tab uh, and i move uh, in this kind of a file explorer, immediate file explorer and uh, here we go and I can open for example this new blade pressing enter and you see that uh, it's open in the current window and uh, now if I press buffers uh, in common mode I see all my uh, buffers there is uh, a no name, uh, a resource, a blade, a new blade. Now let's say that I want to go into the pizza blade uh, numbered by five. So what I do is uh, write buffer five and I go into this buffer and here we go. Now let's say that we want to open uh, an entire uh, directory with uh, some extension and if we use this command that is args and we write the director resources and view and uh, double star and uh, air blade and here we go what does this command will open all uh, uh, blade file inside the video i let reviews and here we go if i press okay. if i write buffers here are all my buffer open it, and you see that are essentially blade file i can use next i can move into into the next and uh, I can or use prev and I can navigate uh, among these uh, buffers and it's very nice or I can I, I repeat I can use buffer the number one and uh, I, so I can I can go to the file easily and uh, I can for example, using uh, an interesting command tab all and all buffer will be opened into this um, into tabs and it's very nice and this is it's uh, very we saw how to uh, to open uh, buffers navigate uh, among but, uh, buffers and using this command R A R we can see all the buffer in a line and uh, uh, surrounded by brackets so we have uh, the uh, current uh, buffer opened in this case on blade you see that is opened and uh, so another is another command this is very interesting uh? and uh, i think uh, if you use a shell uh, secure shell you can use this uh, built-in uh, navigation system of vim but it's uh, very interesting thank you for watching uh, uh, don't forget to subscribe